welcome back to my channel. Hope you're having an amazing day. I'm having an amazing day as well. <laughs> Don't know what the fuck that was in the beginning, girl. Anyways, today's K-pop video is going to be a little bit different. We are going to get into the 2020 Mama Awards. Now, the 2020 Mama Awards are happening this weekend. And you already know, your homegirl is going to watch it. It's going to be like, what? It's going to start like at 7 in Korean time. But I'm going to watch it like at five in the morning girl i can't wait so i thought what better way to prepare for everything is getting into the nomination this year and loading and predicting which song or artist is going to take home the award now without further ado let's get into this video look look at how much votes they have 412 million okay so guys i have my sister here she's gonna help me please be nice now we have the voting thing here all set up and then we're just gonna get into it um my vision's kind of foggy on the lesser awards let's see oh uh, what i thought i was signed in so we're gonna go into best OST. <laughs> I don't see no shows or movies. You know, we're going to vote for Joy because Joy is from Red Velvet. All right, now we're going to go into Best Collaboration. Um, This song is really good, but I like this a bit more when we disco. You heard it, right? No. I sung it a couple of times in this house, but a lot of people like this because it's popular too. You know, I'm going to just go for when we disco. It was a cute song. By the way, my prediction who's probably going to win is these three. Mm-hmm. My vision is a little bit foggy, though, so. Now we're going to go to best hip-hop and urban music. Girl, my prediction is like him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry that my vision is kind of foggy, my prediction of these. But my mind and my visions are more prior to the more important categories you feel me not saying that these other categories are not important they are important but to me the bigger ones or the more ones that people are more familiar are the ones that are more important so i'm sorry now we're gonna go to best band performance uh, i don't know i don't know you know what i'm gonna go with day six because i know them my vision's foggy on that prediction who's gonna win best vocal group performance Ooh, i love mama moo i love mama moo and their vocals always be amazing i might have to go with mama moo i think mama moo might win there's also these three i'm eyeing on but mama moo definitely mm -hmm. now we're gonna go to best vocal performance solo Ooh. Uh, Oh, this is kind of hard because, okay, we're doing based on vocals, all right? Even though I do love this song, especially this song. I love it. I heard it the other day. It came on my radio. Thank goodness they recommended it to me because it's so, so good. But I have to give it to Miss Taeyong on Spark because that is amazing. Her vocals, period. Now we're going to go to Best Desk. <laughs> Can you shut up? Blackpink. <laughs> now we're gonna go to best dance performance female group. We're talking about their dance performance. How you like that? I don't know because. <laughs> how, how you like that? Boom, 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 because boom, boom. these four are really good. Eyes one really good at their swan dance. More and more because their dancing has been really, you know, dancing, you know? Like really out there. Is Blackpink nominated for anything else? I think so. Hold okay, on. so then pick twice because Red Bull, I mean, Blackpink, they, they do like the same like type of dances, but like I really like that dance. But then Twice is doing like other stuff different. So like, yeah, Twice. I feel like I'm in school trying to explain my answer on why I choose A. <laughs> even though Itzy, they really came through with that iconic shorter thing. Fine, so we're going to go for Twice. Even though my prediction says that IS1 might take the winning for this one. My prediction? Yeah, my vision, Raven. Go. Now we gotta go to best dance performance, male group. Ooh. I am not in 
Like no, wait, wait a Cookie. minute. We're just gonna kick kick it. Cause I just like the dance is I don't know. BTS might win or someone else might other win, but I want NCT one two seven to win. But I feel like it's either gonna be them or them. Now we're gonna go to best at performance solo. <gasps> Jessie's nominated. Oh, I want her to win so bad. Uh, I really do. Uh, she really popped. I love Jessie. Oh, I wish me and her were best friends. Us New Yorkers. We gotta stay together. She's a New Yorker? Yeah. Really? Yes. That's homegirl. Taman might win the sexy daddy, but I really want <laughs> Jess Jessie to win. Hwasa might win too. Now we're gonna go to best female artist. Ooh. I personally feel like Chunga, I don't know. Because she started off the year great with State Tonight. And then she released Play and she kind of lost my interest. The dance was cute though. But is she best female artist? I don't know. By the way, she has an album coming out finally. Or her first full album is coming out in like two months. And she's dropping a song in like in a few days, a few weeks. I don't know. I don't know. She did a really good job though. Mm-hmm. So did Taehyun too. I brought IU to win though. She just that she's that bitch, period. You know, we're gonna give it to her. I don't know who's gonna win. Maybe IU. I feel like IU's gonna win. If not, Taehyung or maybe Sun Me though. Girl, I don't know. Oof, my brain's not functioning right now. Now we're gonna go to best male artist. Taemin. That's it. No. <laughs> that's it. He been slaying. That's it. Now we're gonna go to best female group. Um, Blackpink. Oh, gosh. Blackpink Black is the revolution. I will say Blackpink has been slaying. Even though I do want to give it a Red Velvet and Twice. But Red Velvet basically did nothing this year. And that's because... You know, sad and Wendy had her accident literally at the end of last year and she had to recover. And twice, Noni had like two comebacks this year. But Blackpink really has been slain. So I is one. Mm-hmm. So we have to give her the Blackpink. This is like 2018, but like better. Now we're gonna go to best male group. I we already know we all know that BTS is gonna win. If <laughs> BTS doesn't win though, it'll be a shocker because my vision tell me and my prediction are telling me that BTS will win no matter what. Best new female artist. I don't know these people. Um, you know what? I've been seeing a few of their videos and hearing some of their songs, and they slap. So, period. They're gonna get the vote. Now we're gonna go to best new male artist. Ooh, I really want Treasure. Mm hmm. Oh, yes. Some of the songs be slapping. Mm hmm. And they finally kind of debut. I'm on fire. <laughs> That's not the song. I know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Now we're gonna go to Worldwide's Fan Choice. Now, this is something that the fans are gonna vote for. And geez, Lord, this is all that's here. Oh my gosh, there's so much to choose from. I really don't know who's gonna win. This can literally be anyone's category. You know, I did it twice win last year. Some, I forgot who won last year. Was it twice? Hold up. Ah, oh, it was BTS. What? You know what? They're probably they're they're gonna win. Now we're gonna go into the main categories, which is song of the year. Ooh. Now they throw us a whole bunch of songs, but then towards the main show. They were all narrowed down to like seven choices. Blackpink. Over Dynamite? Duh. Wow. The heck. Because here's the thing, all right? I hope the BTS army don't try to kill my ass. <laughs> because they, these K-pop fans, they be violent. And it be mad, like upsetting because I'm a K-pop fan too. Like, before you girls came into the picture, I was one of the original OGs. Like, I found out about K-pop back in 2009. Like, I'm the original Nomi Sop. And some of these people be, like, harsh. Like, no! And it's like, chill. Girl, like, this ain't Rick and Bile speaking words. 
<laughs> it's like people want to jump and do th these things and it's like it's terrible like don't get me wrong i love bts right i love them and this song dynamite is way better than last year's boy with love that they won with i do not like boy with love like it has broke records and it has i think it was like num the first korean act to hit number one here in the billboard for the u.s so that that's um that's a nice accomplishment Ooh. bts and they have been like breaking records with that song but at the same time red velvet psycho she's she has been <laughs> staying and creeping in the top five in the top ten and she's like even though that song came out last the last few days of 2019 she has been one of the best songs for 2020 and people have been stating that that's song of the year for 2020 and she's one of the most like like girl group songs at the moment but then you have blackpink's how you like that that, Girl. Goes, that song goes hard you know what there's a difference between these three songs this is a very feel good song it makes you feel good this is a very melodic song the rhythm and everything you just get into it and it takes you places but then this song goes hard and it makes you feel like a bad beat you know so i don't know it's up to those three but i feel like even if we vote for anything, I feel like BTS is still gonna win. So let's just... Which one? Blackpink or... Red Velvet? Blackpink. Oh jeez. Okay, how you like that? And then Artist of the Year, Blackpink. Hello. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hello. Like, don't get me wrong. B don't get me wrong. Like, BTS, they have been slaying and stuff. And they've been giving out and breaking records but blackpink really came this year they really did and they finally gave everyone what they needed so this is what we voted i feel bad for red velvet i really do like i really want to vote for them i just want to give all the awards to everyone because everyone has been slaying the game this year but these are the people that we voted please don't come for us these are just our opinions and yeah we're gonna call it um wrap for this video if you like it please give it a like comment down below who you voted for who you think's gonna win your prediction and stuff and please subscribe to my channel if not i make gaming videos monday is um gaming series i still need to find a game to play for a gaming series wednesdays is k-pop videos and friday is regular random gaming videos and also now i'm streaming on twitch on saturdays and sundays at midnight easter standard time at 9 p.m pacific time i love y'all thank you for watching and see you later for positivity bye <laughs>